From undesirable to undeniable to action figure immortality. Cody Rhodes is here, but that peck has seen better days. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Atlanta, Georgia, weighing in at 220 pounds, the American Nightmare, Cody Rhodes. From undesirable to undeniable to the grandest stage of them all. Made his WWE return in an all-time classic, and then one year later, did something his father was never able to do, compete in the main event of WrestleMania. One task remains for the American Nightmare. Finish the story at the Showcase of Immortals. Ladies and gentlemen, here comes the G vote. The what? The greatest figure of all time, John Cena. And his opponent from West Newbury, Massachusetts, weighing in at 251 pounds, John Cena. Big match John is back where he belongs at the showcase of Immortals. A name he definitely earned. He competed for the WWE Championship in seven consecutive WrestleManias. Since then, Cena has had epic clashes with the likes of The Rock, The Undertaker, and Bray Wyatt. Now, he's already cemented himself as a WrestleMania icon, but I see many more WrestleMania moments in Cena's future. And I think we're going to see one more here tonight. And here we go with the face that runs the place, John Cena. Um, is it just me or is something up with Cena's face tonight? He seems unusually rigid. Maybe it's just the lighting in the arena, but something definitely seems off about him tonight. I think you might want to get your eyes checked, Corey, because that's the John Cena where you... Springboard! Plancha! No sign of hesitation, and that risk gained big rewards. Suplex! Setting foot in the ring now. Toss down. And he goes for the pin. Good officiating there. Referee seeing him the ropes and breaking the count. for that one. Big back body drop. You have to admit, when John Cena's in action, it's almost like a handicap match for WWE Universe is just as much a factor in Cena's matches as he is himself. That has to be a lot for anyone to overcome, Corey. Yeah, there's something to be said about the power of the WWE Universe when they're as supportive of the superstar as they are of Cena. The crowd gets behind him when he gets rolling, and he feeds off of the crowd in return. If you can prevent Cena from getting that sort of energy going, he'll definitely be at a disadvantage. Wrapping the arm over that top rope, attacking the arm. Trying to take away that grip, that range of motion on that end. Inverted DDT. Look at that, Saxton. He's running away. Uh, I wouldn't say that. He's just recomposing himself. Middle rope. What a roundhouse kick. 
Hoist it up. All the way out of Good golly, what a knee. Loving blow. Oh, oh man. Oh, dear. This doesn't look good. Alley -oop. He's heading up top. Thinking big. From the top. Diving elbow drop. Are you kidding me? Cena has no control here. Really preventing Cena from thriving off of the energy of the crowd. He's struggling to find that energy anywhere now. Stop short of two. Still going to take a massive effort to keep him down. Cena's looking weak in the knees. Could spell trouble. World's about to head to the pay window. Crossroads. Cannot keep Cena down. Looking for the victory. Two. An emphatic victory. Here is your winner. and playing around and gets the win. I mean, what else did we expect? It's an action figure. Even if it is Cena's likeness, it's still just plastic.